Jonas Hechtel's brace had secured Köln's shock win over Leipzig on match day 30, Friedhelm Funkel's first since taking charge. Another as Augsburg would boost their survival hopes. Köln had lost their last five away games, but made a rip-roaring start. On eight minutes, Andre Duda produced a jaw-dropping volley, an unstoppable strike from a lavishly gifted player. Augsburg was stunned and melted under wave after wave of Köln attacks. A sweeping team move saw Marius Wolf's dummy allow the ball to run to Florian Kainz. The Austrians' first league goal of an injury-hit season. Köln had scored as many goals in 23 minutes as they had in their previous five away games. Ten minutes later, they made it three with another move of breathtaking quality. Wolf was again involved as he crossed for Duda to make it a double. Köln was simply wiping the floor with the team that had been unbeaten in its last four home games. 3-0 at half-time, Augsburg coach Heiko Herlich's expression told the story. But his team did respond, and two substitutes combined as Frederick Jensen forced the ball to Robert Gumni. The Poles first ever Bundesliga strike came on 54 minutes. Augsburg had failed to score in their last three matches. Augsburg kept pushing and they made another breakthrough eight minutes later as half-time sub Jensen burst into the penalty area and he found the impressive Ruben Vargas. At this stage, a comeback looked well and truly on the cards. Vargas with his sixth league goal of the season. But Köln saw the game out to record back-to-back -back wins and escape the bottom two. Augsburg aren't safe yet.